Alrighty, Miss Patty, so here are the cords. I'm gonna send this to you by photo, but I wanted to explain something to you here. Um, I don't know who's playing this, but uh, when I have something circled, like right here, it's a single note, which means like, for example, F, G, A flat, A flat, A. It's just a single, a single note. And then if it, nothing is circled, then it's an actual chord, you know? And yes, this is actually the only piano I have at the moment, so bear with me. Um, also, the, the chords that are squared are actually fill-ins, because technically you can just play B flat minor to le dirias a la mon, and then, so yeah this the the you can basically play b flat minor all the way through and not play these squared ones these are fillers just to make it sound more full, because it would be tu le diri, oops, hold on, tu le diri, yes. and then we have E flat, this sounds horrible, hold on, tu le diri, tu le diri, yeah, I think this needs a battery, but it's like tu le diri, wait, tu le diri, yes. A la montaña Muévete, muévete, tú le dirías Wait, it's like B flat minor, tú le dirías E flat A la mon A flat, taña And then D flat Muévete, and then C Muévete, and then they can walk up Tú le dirías. Anyway, it's just filler. That's how I, I used to, Sister Mona taught me that, and that's how I used to play it. So it's like B flat minor, E, A flat minor, no, B flat, it's like, Tú le di B flat minor, E flat, A flat, D flat, and then C, F minor, F, G, A flat, A, B flat minor, E flat, A flat, D flat, C, 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 F. But again, those are just fillers. They can play. It, it sounds just the, the, the same if you just, I mean, it doesn't sound the same, but um, if they don't want to add the fillers, they can just do B flat all the way, B flat minor. Because it would be, Tú le dirías a la montaña, muévete, muévete. Tú le dirías a la montaña, muévete, muévete. But if they don't want to do the fillers, it's just tú le dirías a la montaña, muévete, muévete. Tú le dirías a la montaña, muévete, muévete. So again, the squares, they don't have to play them, they're just fillers. And you actually, when you do play them on the keyboard, let's see, F, I, so, hold on. That's B flat minor. It's only one time. And then E flat. And then A flat. That sounds hard, that is not, that is not what A flat sounds like. Something's wrong with this keyboard. And then D flat. And then C. And then E flat. A flat. D flat. And then C. And then you walk up. And then back to B flat minor. Okay, so that's that. 
And then right here, you know, you start with F minor. I don't know if you guys still play it this way. Si tu vienes, si tu vienes fe, and then you cut on fe. Si tu vienes, si tu vienes fe como un grano, and then you walk. Um, the B flat is one, and then the B is two. You go. Si tu, what is this? Thank you, sweetheart. Okay, thank you. Let me finish this recording though. Si tu vienes fe, I would cut right there. I mean, I think the higher sounds better. Si tu vienes fe como un grano de mostaza, and then I would go to C. So si tu vienes cut, pam, 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 pam. You know the whole. I can't, I can't play that on this thing. I bought this for Caleb, but obviously, yeah. Anyway, um, so that's that's like a walk up. You cut on F minor, so to be in a slap, bum bum, and then you hit C. Dun, 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 eso. I don't know if it's eso lo dice el señor or así lo dice el señor. And then again, to do it is that you cut, you play F minor and cut, that go, and then B flat, B, and then C, C, the chord of C. And then you go to the Ver the second verse tu le dirías you can just stay on B flat or do you do tu le di B flat B flat minor E flat A flat D flat C C F minor dun 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 walk up and then again B flat minor E flat A flat D flat and C and C F that's that and then Nazareno is one of the easiest songs ever invented because it only has two chords. And believe me, when I learned this song, I tried to make it more complicated, but there's really no way because it's so fast. The lyrics, you have to literally sing the lyrics so fast that there's no way to add additional chords. It's basically F minor and C, back and forth. You know, start with F minor. Let's see if this turns on in. Bajo la sombra de, bajo la sombra de Pedro, se sonaban los internos. Bajo la sombra de Pedro, se sonaban. Yeah, go put it in the fridge. Thank you, sweetie. So it's just F minor, da 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 da, C C C F minor, da 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 da, C C C F minor, no da da da, C C C C F minor, F minor, C C C C F minor, and a da da da, and then um. So that's the whole song, the Bajo la Sombra de Pedro. I didn't know if you wanted the second part, but I did add it. You know, esta noche nos vamos a gozar con Jesús en Nazareno. Or you can say día instead of noche if it's you're saying it during the day. Um, le, le invitamos al Espíritu Santo para que se nos ponga bueno. Sí, sí, nos vamos a gozar. The soloists used to do that, and then the other singers would respond to that. Um, so that's the Nazareno, easiest, easiest song. And then, um, si tuvieras fe, and then, the chorus is very easy. It's just, you start with your, you end with F minor. So, so you go back to F minor, so it's just that. And then there was, I wrote you a little note here. There was that bridge we never added. I never, I usually never sing it because the, when the choir used to sing this song um, and we would do it, sometimes I would be like, you guys need to emphasize the word fe because it's fe. And I would sometimes, I would time sometimes hear Pepe, Pepe. I'm like, we're calling Pepe. I don't know who we're calling. So um, we never. After a while, I stopped singing the bridge. But it's it's Sister Mona taught us that bridge. Pepe, Pepe, Pepe. 
it sounds really nice if you harmonize it all. And, um, but you, you got to make sure you pronounce that fe, not, not, you know, make sure you pronounce, the pronunciation is on point because otherwise it sounds like you're saying Pepe, Pepe, and I don't know who Pepe is. So, you know, if you know a Pepe, he'll come running. If you don't, then I don't know. So if you want the chords to that, I mean, it's basically F minor, C, C, F minor, F minor, C, C, F minor. And then you walk up, walk up, dun, 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 tu le dirias. Yeah. And also remember that on Si Tu Eres Fe, you can actually, if you're singing this song fast. You can slow it down right there. And I remember I would be like, slow down. And then you can end it on the chorus, on the verse too. Get it all slow. You slow it down at that point. La montaña, muévete, muévete. You can end it right there, or you can jump start again and go. Go back to the chorus full beat. So yeah, we the verse two is something that you can slow down. Alrighty, I'm gonna take a photo of this and send it to you, and then. Um, I'll upload this and you can share it with whoever's gonna play it and I hope they understand me. And if they don't, I'm always, tell them to send me a, give them my phone number. I'm always happy to help. Alrighty then, talk to you later, bye.